This new report is called the Food Wastage Footprint, and it's quantifying the impact of food wastage on natural resources. Food wastage is a key issue for food security. Indeed, one third of all the food that is produced ends up not being eaten. This means that all the natural resources that were used to produce and process this food have been used in vain. We know that natural resources are scarce and they are the basis of agricultural system. Therefore, food wastage is putting undue pressure on these systems. The blue footprint of food wastage is 250 cubic kilometer of water. To give you an idea, these represent three times the volume of Lake Geneva, or in other terms, the annual discharge of the Volga River, the Zambezi River, or the Ohio River. Food waste contribute to the expansion of the agricultural front, causing deforestation and loss of species. It also contributes to the intensification of fishing effort and therefore the reduction of fish stocks. Almost 30% of the total agricultural land area of the world is used to produce food that is finally wasted. This represents an enormous area. It's the equivalent of China plus Mongolia plus Kazakhstan. The carbon footprint of food wastage is 3.3 gigaton CO2 equivalent. In other terms, this means that the greenhouse gas emission from food wastage are equivalent to twice the greenhouse gas emission of the entire road transportation system of the USA in 2010. In other terms, if food wastage was a country, and if it was integrated in a ranking of the most emitting country of greenhouse gas emission, food wastage will be the third most emitting country right after China and the US. The toolkit presents over 80 best practices in food wastage reduction, and these practices are classified according to their environmental impact.